Man, look at the fiddler crabs here. I have to be careful I don't accidentally step on any of them. I mean, there are thousands and thousands of fiddler crabs here. And these appear to mostly be the type of fiddler crab called a sand fiddler, a uh, yucca pugilator. And I can tell because they have these real pretty sort of porcelain looking backs. Some, in fact, some people call this crab a china back fiddler because they have these great sort of china looking patterns on their back. They look almost like porcelain. Uh, now this is a male fiddler crab and I can tell because he has one large claw and he also has a small feeding claw. So that's how important finding a mate is, that you're willing to sacrifice an entire eating apparatus so that you can attract the mate. And so male filler crabs will stand next to the burrow and they'll wave that claw and that's how they find the female crab of their dream, so to speak. And uh, this claw, although it looks really, really dangerous, is really not too bad. I mean, it pinches pretty good, but it's uh, actually this one pinches pretty well. It, uh, they're fairly sharp, and, but it's not dangerous to people at all. Fiddler crabs feed on pluff mud. And what they do is pull up little particles, or little piles of pluff mud, put it into their mouth parts, and then they glean out the things they like to eat. Algae, uh, all sorts of small animals and things. And that's what they ingest. The rest of it they spit back out. And they form these little balls. And you'll see these all across the marsh. What's kind of neat is so fiddler crabs, while they're feeding, they're actually cleaning the marsh. And they're also aerating it and doing things like that. So we have just one species. There are actually three types of fiddler crabs that we have in the low country. We have the sand fiddler, like this one. We have the mud fiddler. And then we have another one called the red jointed fiddler crab. Let's look for a couple other species. All right, here is the species that I was most excited about seeing. This is called a red jointed fiddler crab. And the first thing you notice about this crab is look how big it is. I mean, this is probably twice as big as your standard fiddler crab. This species is Yucca minax, and it is the red jointed fiddler crab. And you can see there are little red joints between the claws here, and actually at the base of the claw. And this is obviously a male. And you can tell, look at this huge claw. And this one probably pinches pretty hard. We'll just kind of see. <laughs> you can see them kind of pulsing. And, uh, you know, this is a pretty formidable weapon. And you can imagine things like birds and stuff might, be, uh, might not be willing to pick one of these up because of this claw. The other claw is the feeding claw. And that's what it uses to scoop up pluff mud and to get it to its mouth parts where it can process it and get things to eat. Anyway, beautiful crab. This is one that you generally find in areas where fresh water is running into the marsh somewhere. So if you can find an area where rainwater rushes in or, or something like that, you're going to see a lot more red jointed fiddler crabs. So we'll put this guy back down and let him kind of carry on about his business. Mm -hmm. 